Okay, Tater, maybe you can help me out here. I got out um, all these bolts along the side, and I took out four Allen bolts there. There's still one here, three there. We got out two bolts here, two long bolts here, long bolt there, and long bolt there. All of the bolts along the side here, <coughs> including the ones at the top that go in from the opposite direction. Now, um, do I need to take this off the, the flywheel, this, this nut, and pop that out because uh, I'm trying to separate these and not having too much luck. So I'm wondering what all I am missing. I got the carburetors off, got the ignition stuff off, you know, the starters out of the way, electricals out of the way. Um, I actually took a lot more video uh, on how to take it apart, but I'm going to put all that together as one long video when, I, um, when, when the job's all done. So right now I just need to know what step I'm missing as far as separateness goes. Or is it just that it's on that, that good? You mentioned, um, you mentioned tapping the flywheel with the mallet, so I'm wondering does that nut need to come off the top of it? Or maybe I need to take off more of these Allen bolts. I'm not exactly sure what they're, if they're holding something on in the inside, that's why I don't want to just pull them off just yet. But, uh, well, hopefully somebody will say something to me before the sun goes down, but um, so far everything's 